Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to write a repeating number or a repeating decimal as a fraction using algebra. So the first thing I'm going to do is start out with n equal to my repeating decimal. And I'm going to go over here and leave some space. Okay, now I need to know that 0 0.3232, that means this repeats like this. Okay, and I could scribble out the bar there on the top. So the same thing though. Now what would I have to multiply this number by to get the whole pattern on the other side? In other words, I want a whole number here that's equivalent to the part that repeats. So basically what I want to do is I want to have 32 over here, okay? I want 32 because that's the part that repeats, and it continues to repeat 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, 2. Okay, now, what would I multiply that by to get that decimal two places over there? I'd multiply it by 100. So this is what the value of 100 in is. So 100 in is 32.323232 and so on. And n is 0.3232 and so on. So what if I subtract these? Because if I subtract them, then I got rid of the repeating part so I don't have to worry about it. And on the right, all that I have is 32. Because I don't have a repeating part anymore because I got rid of it. Because that was on both sides, so if I subtract it, whatever it is, it's going to go away. Then 100 in minus n would be 99 in. And then I just solve for n by dividing both sides by 99. Now, this won't, re this won't um, reduce, so my answer is 32 over 99. So 32 as a fraction, that's re the, as, ooh, 0 0.32 repeating as a fraction is 32 over 99. 